Hey, this is Jacob Moreno with Arometer Company. Today, I'm going to show you how to create a new account and register a new device on the AeroCloud platform. The first thing we're going to do is go to www.aerocloud.com. And once we get there, we'll see the, the link that says create new account. We're going to select that. It's going to take us to our registration form. And once we get there, we're going to put in our email, our name, our password. Make sure you meet all the password requirements down below when creating a password. Once you do that, you hit register. You'll see this tab here. The register tab will, will tell you to go to your email because you should be receiving one shortly from Arometer. So once you do, you go to your email. You'll be receiving an email from tech support at arometer.com. And when you open that email, there will be a link down at the bottom. You're going to click that link and it will take you back to aerocloud.com. It tells you that your email has been successfully verified, but you're going to need to wait for a secondary email for full approval. Uh, this email can take anywhere between five minutes to 24 hours. So just be patient to receive that second email. That second email looks just like this. And once you receive it, you can go ahead and log into your account at AeroCloud. So once you get back to AeroCloud.com, put in your credentials, log in, and this is your main home screen. There's obviously nothing in there right now because we haven't registered any new devices. So that's what we're going to do. So up at the top left corner, it says register new device. You're going to click that. It will take you to the register device uh, window. And you can find that ID number for your device in two places, one of two places, I should say. It's in the box that, that came with the unit uh, on the instruction booklet, or it's actually on the board of your new device. So once you find that number, your ID number, put it in the field, hit confirm, and your new device will be registered into the account. That's how you create a new account, and that's how you register a brand new IC10 device.